Good morning and welcome back to the vlog. Okay, as you guys can see, the bed hasn't even been made and I never walk out of the room without making the bed, but I was actually thinking of my matcha, the way that I want to try it. And I want to try it with my protein. So I'm going to do kind of like a smoothie, but it's just going to be matcha ice, milk, and my, and my um, protein. And we'll see what it tastes like. So I'm making that this morning. I actually need to order another one because I'm almost done. Dennis is making pancakes. He's making protein pancakes with turkey bacon. So I went to Yasmin and Valentin's house like last week, I think it was, or two weeks ago. And she made these Birch Benders pancakes and Dennis loved them, so we went and got them. He's making that and I'm gonna make my smoothie because I noticed that my creamer, which I love, you guys. I'm, you guys know how much I love my, my Trader Joe's creamer. I noticed it has sunflower oil. So I'm trying to think of a way that I can have my matcha that'll still taste good. And I love the way that my protein tastes. So we're making that today. Estamos inventando. I also made rosemary water yesterday. I have to put this in the fridge. I already have some in my little spray bottle. I'm not sure how long this will last, like in the fridge. I need to put it like, I'm gonna put it in this jar actually and close it. But does anybody know how long I can keep this in the fridge? We're gonna use Dennis's protein. And the only reason I'm putting it in the blender, so I'm gonna do a scoop of protein. The only reason I'm doing it in the blender is because I want it to be kind of frothy. I'm excited about this because if it tastes good, then I don't have to use the creamer anymore. So I use the creamer just to like sweeten up the matcha. I'm gonna pour our matcha in there. We threw our date. Mm -hmm. Try this. Mmm. Wow, that's so different. It is really good. so good, you guys. All right, it's time to do the bed in three, two, one. Okay, this is not a satisfying transition because clearly the bed is still not done, but I wanted to show you guys. So we have these pillows from Casa Luna that we've had for a long time. And then it became, this is like the most comfortable pillow, you guys, but then it became like a saggy thong. It was super loose. There was not enough filling in the pillow and I kept trying to find inserts because I really like the case, like the pillowcase. It just, I like the color, I like the texture of it, um, but there's nothing that size. Like I already checked, 26 by 34 is the size of the pillow, like the insert, and they only have 26 by 26 or 20 by 36. And the 20 by 36 that I found is $126 and I'm like, absolutely not. So they still have these at Target. They're $45 each, they're Euro size. So they're perfect for like a king size bed. And so we had two and I told Dennis, I was like, I'm just gonna get two new ones. And he's like, well, let's stuff two in one. And now it's the fluffiest pillow. So I'm gonna go get another one and stuff those two in one. Um, I'll probably just keep these like as extras because obviously I'm gonna have two pillowcases and this one's like already tearing so it's already kind of where is it oh no it's this one because we've had them for a while and I love them where is it oh see right here I just need to like sew it back up um but I'm gonna go get another one I just want to show them to you guys because look at how like thick and fluffy it is now so now the way that I'm gonna do the bed because I also have these which I also love but when I bought this I only bought two um because we had a queen bed but now that we have a king size bed I need three and they no longer have them at Target so my idea is to put the two big ones like that and then put the two small ones in front and I think it's gonna look so good. And then I'm gonna get, I wanna get a quilt from Pottery Barn and it'll kind of like set the tone for the bed. And I feel like now it's gonna feel complete with the quilt and then the pillows. So we might go to Target today and possibly even Pottery Barn if I convince Dennis. But yeah, that's the, that's the plan with the pillows or the bed. We're just gonna put those right there for now. Look at Benji. It's delicious. I also have to give them their vitamin. Are you guys alive? <laughs> hey, bye. I just dropped you guys from here, tumbled to the ground. <gasps> I had the I had the camera right here, and I grabbed my phone, and I accidentally hit the camera. 
I'm calling Air One. Did you see it in slow motion? Yeah. I saw, I saw it in slow motion. I was like, no. <laughs> so Dennis has been wearing Celtic salt, salt, and I got some on Amazon. I paid twenty-eight dollars, you guys. So I thought I was gonna be getting like a hefty bag. Let me show you guys the bag that I got. I was like shocked. I swear, I thought I'm not even exaggerating. I'm like twenty-eight dollars for salt. I'm thinking I'm gonna get a bag this big, like lifetime supply. This is. This is the bag that I paid $28 for. Literally nothing. This is all the salt for $28. And I was like, absolutely not. So I was gonna return it to Amazon and I can't return it anymore. I guess this is like a non-returnable item. So I told Dennis we might as well keep it. But turns out this is from a reseller, that's why. And then they're saying that resellers are selling fakes. So that was another reason I wanted to return it because I thought I was getting it directly from a company that makes it, Selena Naturally but it's from a reseller. So I'm texting Air One to see if they have it in stock. So you know how I, I told you guys I wanted to put a new like quilt or throw on the bed? So I'm gonna test it out on the bed and see if I like it. I have my robe on here because I just got out of the shower. I got, I don't know if you guys can see, but I got into my little giddy set because it's so comfy. Uh, we're just gonna put the robe right there. <laughs> but right now we have this one. And I feel like this is gonna add a little bit of color and contrast to the bed. Let me put it on and I'll show you guys. It is actually way too small. Um, I thought it was gonna be like long enough for me to put on the bed, but it's not. Obviously this bed's a queen and this is actually a throw. So I'm gonna put it on my reading nook uh, chair. We washed all our pillows, all our throw pillow. Uh, <laughs> cases for the pillows that we have on the couch which I'm thinking of removing you guys know we're getting rid of this couch um, I actually have an interior designer coming tomorrow which is so exciting and we're gonna do a completely I want to do a completely new layout of the living room but I just don't I just don't have the eye you guys like this space is way too big it's like a really big space and I feel like we can make it very cozy yet feel put together I don't know we also have two new chairs from Crate and Barrel that we bought for originally a, a project and then we decided we're just gonna use them for the living room so in the living room we're keeping this table because we absolutely love it everything else is going so the couch is going this media console is going um this is stain obviously which is this is where I'm gonna put my little throw which I think is gonna be so cute look at that Adorbs. All right, here's another little project that I did. So I actually already did it to this one. I bought these pillows. Well, I got these from Shop Gitana a while ago, and they were originally for the office when we had Allery. Like these look very boho ish. So I cut the tassels off, and I feel like it looks better. So I'm going to chop these off as well. And I'm also going to get different inserts because these inserts are way too stiff, and I don't like pillows like that. I want to be able to karate chop them in the middle. So I'm gonna get inserts from, 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 oh my God, I can't talk, from Amazon for these and they're gonna look so much better. We are out and about. We decided to go to the furniture store where we bought that table just to see if they have any other little treasures that we may find, uh, especially because we're gonna be not remodeling, but redecorating parts of the house. We made it, you guys. You see how they have like such random things? There's even like, look at this. So we're gonna go, he's over here looking at a car. <laughs> but they have planters, giant ones. Look at this one, it's as big as me. <laughs> Let's get this for the living room. Wait, where's the entrance? Oh, over here. But I love places like this because I feel like it's, it's like a little treasure hunt. So you just don't know what you're gonna find. Like some of the stuff is is questionable. Like the, what is this? What is this art? Let's see what we find. If we find anything, we made it to Target. I came to see if they have the pillows. Um, I don't see them out here, but I asked a guy to check, so he's checking. I did find these two things, which I'll show you guys when I get home, but. This I was looking at. This is like a really nice quilt. But I think I'm gonna just get this throw that I like. I'll let you guys know if I find the pillows because they don't have the color. The one that I'm looking for is in the natural. I'm gonna go over here because I saw some little pumpkins that look cute. Like, 
How cute is this for Thanksgiving? It's so cute. Do I need another mug? I mean, hey boo. Which please? These are all five dollars. Wow, there's like hardly any left. Oh, this one's kind of cute. Actually, I'm gonna take this one. It doesn't take a lot of convincing. Look, babe, is this cute? That's cute. These are nice. These are kind of like the um the ones from Crate and Barrel, but these are a little bit more rounded. The Crate and Barrel are more like squared. Oh wow, these are nice. They're big. And then this is cute. This is nice. Cute. Oh look, four pack glassware sets, $25. So are all these $25? These are nice too. Oh my God, these are so cute. I wish the stem was a little bit thinner, but these are really cute. All right, we're That's getting some toys for the boys. Okay. Look at how cute it's been these a minute. are. It has to be something cool. The candy corn and candy corn. Yeah. It's either gonna be the candy these. corn. The bats? The bats, because there's two of them. So that way oh, can... true, they can each get a little bat. Oh, or, oh there's more? Uh, I think the bats, the bats are cute. Now, I wanna see if they have my waffles. I oh wait, there's more over here. Oh, well, let's see. Oh, no, it's for cats. No. Okay, take Hector this little box right here. Wow, you're such a good cuñado. By the way, he's saying take these for Hector, but it's you. <laughs> you I them. might have one. I might have one. We're home. We're about to give the boys their children to the light on. What do you do? What does mom have? What does mom have? <laughs> Uh -oh. Come here, Odie. Odie. Notice. <laughs> Sit. Go. Odie. Thank you, Bob. He wants to eat. Let's do a little haul of what I got. Um, okay, I got this water pitcher because I thought it was so cute and I love that it's, what is this called, like beveled? It just looks more expensive. It was $20. <coughs> got this cutting board because I love the dark brown. I will link everything that I find um, down below. And then I got this curtain because I thought it was pretty. I like the color. It's like a rust color and I feel like it'll add some color to the bathroom. And I just got a stool from Target, so... Got that shower curtain, and then I got this checkered throw, which I thought was so cute for the bedroom. Morning! Buenos dias, mis chulas, and happy Monday. I just got out of the shower. I did my quick skincare. I put on these retinol eye patches from Murad. Uh, but we are about to have breakfast. We're gonna try the Kodak uh, Power Waffles, buttermilk and vanilla that we got yesterday at Target hoping that these have the crunch that we're looking for. Also today, the interior designer is coming to look at the living room. That's what we're gonna start with, depending on how that works out, the budget and all of that. Obviously, you guys know furniture is so expensive. Like, what is the reason? I always try to look for things that maybe are similar, but like, there was this dining table that I really liked and it was $7,000. Like what? Absolutely not. So I was trying to find, like I even went on, on Facebook Marketplace. Like I don't mind, especially if it's like a vintage table or something like that. So I was looking on there, but I didn't find anything that caught my eye. I changed into my outfit. I'm wearing this little Zara dress, but I wanted to try the waffle with you guys first bite to see if there's a crunch, but I think there is. Mm. Mm-hmm. Very rare sighting of us having breakfast on our island. Five. We never eat here, but I have my waffle, my coffee. Dennis has his coffee. Cheers. Very big difference of his, our. <laughs> yeah. His has peanut butter and honey. You like more a little salty? Mine has cottage cheese mm -hmm. and honey.
just wrapped our meeting with the interior designer. Uh, we're actually gonna go to a like warehouse furniture store that I found. They have like vintage pieces, so I wanna go check it out. Here we go, you guys are coming along. I turned off all the candles. No, I didn't. Candles on. Always make sure to check your house for candles, please. I need to, and you're not supposed to blow them up. Okay. He got his almond croissant. Oh, but this one's chocolate. This is chocolate. And we're taking some bagels to our guys. This is where we live. I know, I'm so excited for that. Thank, Thank you. you. Of course. So we shared the bagel because as you guys can see the bagel's huge. I came in for pillows, you guys. I have a problem. But they're right there. We found them. Oh look at these little pumpkin ones. And the next dun dun dun. This is literally my favorite section of Target. It makes me so happy. I don't know if they have anything new because I feel like I've already seen all this. What is this? Oh, this is another shower curtain. You're happy. <laughs> no, I am happy. We came to the Yabdeckies. Yeah, I, I was craving this sometime, uh, I think it was like last week. Yeah. I'm bored. You guys, look at this. This is our Yup Duck order. Extra mild, only rice cake, no fish cake. We had seaweed rolls, dumplings, veggie fries, ramen. Thank you. And it is so good. Thank you, appreciate it. Okay, we're going to eat. We're starving.